Now, this FIFO buffer that we have talked about is once again something which, you know, how would you implement something like this in hardware? There is a fairly straightforward way of doing it. One way of looking at it would be that, you know, you have this block which takes in data, right? And along with that, it also takes in a signal called valid in. Okay. And it takes in one more, uh, uh, or rather on the left hand side, basically it takes in this valid in. And at the same time, it also has to give out the signal called ready out. Okay. And what we are saying is, if valid in and ready out, right, you look at the code that we have down here, what that is saying is the previous module, right? So let's say that I have a block like this, A, B, and F, right? This F is what corresponds to this FIFO, okay? Not A and B, right? A and B are the two processes that are trying to communicate. They are trying to communicate through the FIFO F, right? And what F is telling A is it gives it the ready out signal. Whereas valid in comes from A to F, right? And if both of these conditions are satisfied, we can put a value into the FIFO, right? Similarly, on the other side where F is communicating to B, what I would say is valid out goes from F to B and ready in comes from B to F, right? So this sort of handshaking, right? This is essentially something called a handshaking protocol. Right? And this handshaking is what allows us to communicate transparently between A and B through the FIFO F, right? Now, if I assume that F is unbounded, Right? That is to say, there is no limit on the amount of data that it can have. The one thing that you can notice over here is that ready underscore out, this signal on the left hand side should never become equal to, should never become false, should never become equal to zero. Right? Because effectively what it's saying is the FIFO is always ready to accept more data. Right? There is no bound on how much data it can occupy. On the other hand, by having that signal over there, what we have allowed is that very easily by you know, uh, having a, one extra piece of logic, we are able to say that, look, if this is a finite FIFO, it will still be able to tell A to stop pushing more data in. 